welcome back to another computer sluggish video. Have you subscribed to my YouTube channel yet? If not, be sure to click on the big red subscribe button and click on the bell to get notified when I upload a new video. Also, don't forget to check out my social media channels. In today's video, as requested on my new forum, I will be showing you how to make triangles in GIMP. To start off with, first you need to open up the document or create a new document that you would like to create a triangle on. As you can see, I do have a blank document at the moment. We now need to go to the left hand side and select the free select tool, or you can press F to select this. And you now simply need to click with the left button on your mouse, and you then need to do a triangle shape and click again. And we can now do a line down again and click and then we can go across to the circle and link the triangle up. And there we go. We currently have a basic triangle like you can see there. And if I now press enter, it will select that area. If we now select our bucket tool and just fill that area, we have a basic triangle. We have drawn this triangle onto our background, which means I cannot actually move the triangle because it will move the background as well. Now, time to show you how to draw a triangle, but let's make this triangle a bit better. First, we're going to create a new layer. To do this, we're going to go down to the bottom right hand corner of GIMP and click on new layer. We're now going to keep this layer name as number two on my screen but you can call this layer name whatever you want you can name it triangle if you'd like you now need to make sure fill with is on transparency and we can now go ahead and press ok you now need to make sure you have the second layer selected like i do now and we now need to click on our free select tool again in the top left hand corner and this time you now need to click and we're now going to hold down control on our keyboard which locks the line, as you can see it's locking it, which will make us do a more accurate triangle. And we can go ahead and click. And keeping control down, we can then click again, and keeping control down again, we can then link it to the circle. I'm actually going to let go of control and click on the circle, and I'm now going to select the circle and hold down control and move it up a bit and there we go that's locked in and as you can see that triangle is actually better we can now go ahead and press enter again and it will then select we can then click on our bucket fill and click in the triangle and there we go if we now select our move tool from the top left hand corner we can then move this triangle around as you can see and we can place it wherever we like you can also use the guidelines to help create triangles. To use a guideline, all you need to do is click on the top and simply drag down on the ruler and you will see a line. You can then just place it. We could then drag it down again using the guidelines and then place it there. And then we can use the left hand side ruler and we could go there and then we could do it again like so. And that's just a basic guideline. As you can see, it's, it's almost an even square. I actually just kind of dragged it anywhere. As you can see, this one here is not down enough. But yeah, you can then use your guidelines to make a more perfect triangle. And also remember to hold down control when doing it. And that is it for this tutorial. I hope it did help and give you a better understanding on creating triangles in GIMP. If you do have a tutorial you'd like me to do, then head on over to my forum. The link is in the description below. And post your request and I will see if I can do it for you. Anyway, don't forget to hit the like button below and subscribe for more computer sluggish tutorials. Don't forget to check out my social channels.